What's going on guys? Break Haven here for another fragrance review. I've been tagged by Ruth's Gifted Hands to list my most ruthless fragrances. Appreciate the tag and let's get started. We're gonna start off with Baccarat Rouge 540 X Straight. If I'm meeting someone for the first time, I'm always absolutely grabbing for this one first. It's never missed. It's a, it's a can't miss. I've never failed. Every time I've worn this fragrance to meet a girl for the first time, they've always said something about it. So if it ain't broke, don't fix it. This puts a cloud around you all day. It's sweet. It has that almond note in it. It's just, it goes in my top five for life. So if I'm meeting someone, it's absolutely this one. This one is ruthless, guys. Next, we have Zaharoff Signature. You guys know my love for Zaharoff Signature. This is the ultimate masculine manly scent now I do know a few women that wear this fragrance because it's just a pleasant fragrance overall but when you talk about a lavender based fragrance this is absolutely the one this is fresh out of the shower I just got shaved up you know what I'm saying I just got my hair cut I just got the fade on the side and I'm pulling out the Zaharo signature it's a can't miss it's an easy grab and it's by far one of my most ruthless fragrances. It's a hard signature. Moving on. Next, we have Walk on the Wild Side, Bite or Love. Now, typically, I'm not into, into leather fragrances, but my gosh, is this leather. When I say this is leather, I mean this is the inside of a Porsche Panamera. This is leather seat, shiny. You know how when you first get a car, how the steering wheel looks so new and tight, and you can smell your hands and it smells like the steering wheel? That's what this is. This is a leather, this is a, for all you leather fans, this is a dream scent for a leather lover. I'm not big on leather, but with that said, this one here, yeah, this one is super ruthless. Hence the name, Walk on the Wild Side. Moving on. Last but not least, and this is a shameless plug. So listen, if you got your fragrance on, more than likely you're clean. More than likely you just hopped out of the shower. So if you just hopping out of the shower, more than likely you probably should be using a nice soap. So with that said, we're gonna talk about the Bare Fruit Bar Soap. Now, as you can see the ombre effect, if you look at the bottom of this, you see the sandalwood and myrrh base. And all throughout here is just this light, refreshing pina colada scent. So when I'm talking about my most ruthless fragrance, it starts in the shower. So what better than have a nice soap? The Bare Fruit Bar Soap. Shameless plug. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Thank you, Ruth, and I'll see you guys soon.